What is up Midway Mayhem fans? This is Dan and we are checking back in from the Universal Orlando Resort for yet another Jurassic World Velocicoaster construction update. Hopefully we catch some more testing. Let's go! Hello Lighthouse. It's cold again. Somewhere in the 40s and 50s. Park doesn't seem too busy. Like usual, ticket windows are not busy. Turnstiles on the right, well one of them's open. And there's more on the left. We'll go this way. Right on through. Temperature check, security, and the front entrance. And we are on our way. Wait times. Park is open until 6 and we can see most everything has about a 40 to 45 minute wait. P Flyers was at 25. Seuss Charlie is at 10 minutes. 75 minutes for the Hogwarts Express. Ouch. Fly Fine Blue Little is closed. Forbidden Journey 20 minutes. Jurassic Park 10 minutes. Hagrid's at 45. And there's the Jurassic World Velocicoaster. I'm not seeing any lifts or cranes in the air. Tons of workers all over the site. And again, fingers crossed, we'll be able to see some daytime testing coming up in a little bit.
the ride has made probably 35 test runs since I've been here, and they've been doing rollback tests. We actually had a rollback in launch one, and probably four or five of them on launch two earlier. At the beginning of today's video, they were testing very, very rapidly. Towards the end of the night, they slowed way down. There's only been one run in the last 50 minutes. Park just closed, so it's about time to get out of here, guys. that's going to do it for another update here from the Universal Orlando Resort for a Jurassic World Velocicoaster construction update. Happy to say lots of testing today. Well over 35 test runs. Bunch of rollbacks also, probably five or six of them. But yes, they're doing lots of tests during the day now and we'll be back for it. So if you like what we do, follow us on Instagram, Facebook, YouTube, and Twitter at Midway Mayhem. And I will see you out on the Midway.